If uh, if you were to think about it today, mm-hmm. uh, how much would would you be net short? Like, would you have more of your exposure short than long? Um, I don't know. I think for us is like we we just we like to be short for events. Okay. Um. So. And this is like this is that big Tesla question. And you, uh, do you know Mark Cahodes or do you know of Mark Cahodes? No, of yeah. Yeah, so he's always saying, like, you know, this Jaguar on the tree thing. It's like, you don't want to go in for the fight. You just want to wait until this Jaguar has fallen off the tree so you can go in for the kill kind of thing. Mm-hmm. And I think that's always been the case. And he's attributed this to, like, Tesla, right? And Tesla is super controversial. Yeah. Um, on one side, you have these guys on Twitter relentlessly going after this company with really, really good data to support them. And... You know, that you have a CEO that's sort of, he's eccentric to say the least. Um, <laughs> and, you know, over promises, gets in trouble with the SEC all the time, calls guys pedos and all this other crap. And the, the always is promoting something new with Tesla. And there's this sort of entrepreneurial like mindset where like I'm going to start a new project before I finish my first one kind of thing Mm -hmm. and it keeps going and and it creates it created this cult really Mm. where there's so many people that love Elon Musk and love Tesla and they own a car and even when the car is like garbage they will still you know complain like if you look at complaints on Tesla it's great because it's like it always starts like hi Elon love Tesla and love your work, but uh, my car won't start. Uh, the boots leaking water. Um, you know, I get a flat tire every three months, whatever. And the service center hasn't responded to any of my queries for two months. Can you please help? And it's so obscure. Like, if I bought a thirty-five thousand dollar car, like US dollar car, I'd be pissed off if my trunk was leaking and like no one responded to my service requests. And it's not like you can take it to any shop, right? Like, mm-hmm. you, you can't. It's a Tesla. It's their own thing. They have to do it themselves, kind of. So it's like owning a Mac. You just have to take it to a genius. But the geniuses are there. Whereas Tesla, they don't really have... I'm sure there's some geniuses, but they're not, they're not going to fix your car really quick. <laughs> okay. And so... And then that's... The, yeah, so that's really... That's like what's really hard, because you have such like a huge cultist community that love this guy. So why would you want to like, go short right now? Mm. And it's it's working for them. Like the short's been pretty good over the last year. I think it's down from what like three hundred and something to two hundred and thirty now. Or something mm. like that. Yeah, I mean the short's great, and the the short argument, in my opinion, is flawless. But mm. the, you, you fighting have- the, the fight is not really worth it for us.